clinical psychologists research causes and treatments for mental disorders. They might work in a laboratory setting, collecting and analyzing data and writing scientific reports. They might also um, work in a psychiatric ward, providing face-to-face -face services for clients, or they might do both. They might integrate their clinical work with their research. Social psychologists are primarily concerned with uh, interactions between individuals. So they might be concerned with peer pressure, collective goals, beliefs. For example, the Florida Gators. We might have the collective belief that we're number one, we're the best, um, and we'll have the, the goal that we're going to win. We're going to win the national championship, and we're going to wear orange and blue to show our membership in the group of the Florida Gators. We already talked about social psychologists and how they're concerned about interactions between individuals. Well, personality psychologists deal with just the individual. So what defines you as a person? Um, they'll study different traits like openness to experience, conscientiousness, extroversion, agreeableness, neuroticism. Um, but again, the focus is on the individual rather than interactions between individuals. Developmental psychologists deal with changes and thoughts and behaviors over the lifespan. So changes that occur from birth to death. Much of the field is focused on child development. We'll learn um, theories about different stages of child development a little bit later on in the semester. But um, again, the field is, is focused on how individuals develop thoughts and behaviors over the lifespan.